So today I'm going to take you through a day in my life this summer and I just really love myself. So I decided to take a really, 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 really hard class over the summer. I mean, I guess it's not that bad because I'm not gonna have to take this class during the fall. So my fall schedule is gonna be way easier. And by easier, I mean like still hard, but like slightly less hard than usual. But anyways, let's stop watching me sleep because it's kind of creepy and let's get started with our day. When it comes to alarms, I have a special method that I like to do. So I set two alarms five minutes apart. When I wake up to the first one, I just turn it off so then I have five more minutes of sleep five minutes later And when I get to the second one I put that one on snooze so I get an extra ten minutes after that unnecessarily long process I finally awake from my slumber and at this point I just like to stare into the void for a few minutes It's finally time to go to the bathroom and start my extensive morning routine and by extensive I literally mean just doing a few basic things so I start off by washing my face and then after that I brush my teeth and then I finish off by looking at how big my under eye bags are getting day by day okay and I also use the toilet but I'm not gonna show you that because it's kind of nasty so now it's time to make my bed because I was raised right as a child so I have a pro tip for you guys if any of y'all are like waking up and going to classes you're probably really sad sad and tired so you're not gonna have the time or energy to fully make your bed and tuck the sheets in and all of that nonsense so what I like to do is I just like fold it in half and it really makes your bed look like it's made and it really makes your life look put together and your bed look made so I definitely recommend using this method because it's really effective then I go to choose my outfit now this part's really hard because I can either go comfortable and look like trash or I can look stylish and I almost choose comfort but today I want to look good for you guys so I'm gonna you stylish after putting all of my supplies in my super stylish backpack it's time for breakfast now I literally never get hungry in the morning but I know that I have to eat something or I'll probably like pass out and die so I just like to eat these Quaker granola bars which these are not sponsored by the way but they're just so freaking good and I love eating these and while I eat them I just kind of stare into the void again But then we have to go to class. Ew! On this trip to class, I feel really disconnected from reality because I'm just so tired. But anyways, we have to stop by the printer because I have to print out my homework. But can we just appreciate how evenly this printer stacks the paper? Like, this is so beautiful. And after we make it up some very labor-intensive stairs, we finally make it to class. The class I'm taking is fluid mechanics and literally it's so hard. And the lectures are two hours long and I literally just want to like cry try and leave after like 10 minutes. One eternity later. After deep frying my brain like six times, it's finally time to get out of class and today's a Tuesday. And let me tell you guys why that's important. So I have this app that gives me a free taco every Tuesday. Like, can you believe that? A free taco? So I'm going straight to Taco Bell to get my free nacho cheese Doritos Locos taco. And now we're gonna do a little mukbang for y'all. Okay. Ew. It's like... Mm -hmm. mm. When I'm done with that meal from the heavens, I have two hours of free time and literally all I do for the entirety of that time is lay down in bed and watch YouTube. Judge me, I don't care. It makes me happy and I'm not gonna stop. But recently I found my old Nintendo DS, so I've been playing that during some free time. Two hours later. It's time to go back to class. I'm actually not going to class. I'm going to lab, which is like doing experiments and stuff. So the sad part about this is I have to wear jeans Jeans. Like I'm fine with jeans, but it's summer in Texas and it's like a hundred degrees outside So wearing jeans is not a good idea So on the way to lab, I literally drench all of my clothes and they're soaking wet by the time I get inside But we're finally in lab and today we're doing a really fun experiment We're actually learning how to incubate our own aliens so that we're prepared for the area 51 raid in September Lab really tires me out because it's just a bunch of long processes to do but once I finally get home I just pass out
I literally have no idea how long I was passed out for, but it's dark outside now and I kind of have to study, but I'm also really hungry, so I'm gonna make dinner now. As you can see by my very sad fridge, I literally need to go grocery shopping because there's nothing in here. So today I made some quesadillas. I have this quesadilla maker that like you just put in your tortillas, your cheese and all that stuff. And it just makes your quesadillas for you so easy. And literally they're so freaking good. Like I could eat this breakfast, lunch and dinner 24 seven, 365. Like, they're just so good. After dinner, I just need to get it together and start studying because I'm going to have to get prepared at some point. So so here's me studying. As you can see, I'm literally so smart. Like, look how fast I'm going. Ha ah, I'm just kidding. This is just a time lapse. Oh my gosh, that was such a good joke. When I'm done, obviously I need to treat myself. So let me tell you guys about this really good dessert I got the other day. It's this key lime cheesecake. And the thing about this is that it's French style, which I don't think I've ever had a French style cheesecake. But it's so good. It's literally like cheesecake cheesecake but if it were a pudding because you know how cheesecake is like really creamy well this is like the creamiest of the creamy cheesecakes and at that point it's late so i shower brush my teeth and then go to sleep Okay, honestly, I might watch YouTube for a few hours before I go to sleep, but like, that's technically sleeping. And the next morning, I wake up and do it all again. Just kidding! I don't have class the next morning! But the sad thing is, I have to still study for my test that's on Thursday. So I gotta go. Bye!